This is Alan Hirohara speaking on the Speed Bridge Rotator Cuff Repair augmented with Arthroflex Acellular Dermal Extracellular Matrix. The Arthrex Speed Bridge is a knotless double row rotator cuff repair that combines fully threaded swivel lock anchors with fiber tape to create a strong and low profile construct while minimizing surgical steps. The rotator cuff footprint is prepared using the power rasp and torpedo shaver. The anterior medial bone socket is prepared at the articular margin. A vented swivel lock with a preloaded fiber tape loop is inserted into the socket. The preloaded fiber tape loop is released from the thumb pad and the number 2 fiber wire tip retention suture is discarded. The fiber tape is retrieved laterally. The fiber tape limbs are joined into a single tail to allow easy passage with a fast pass scorpion, which automatically retrieves the pass suture. The fiber tapes are moved to an accessory portal and the process is repeated for the posterior medial anchor. A vented swivel lock with a preloaded fiber tape loop is inserted into the socket. The preloaded fiber tape loop is released from the thumb pad and the number 2 fiber wire tip retention suture is discarded. The fiber tape is retrieved laterally. The fiber tape limbs are joined into a single tail to allow easy passage with a fast pass scorpion, which automatically retrieves a pass suture. A measuring device is now used to determine the exact distance between the two sets of sutures that have been passed through the edge of the rotator cuff. A power pick is used to create vascular channels to enhance blood flow for healing. Two holes are punched into the graft using a 14 gauge needle. Approximating the distance between the two anchors in the medial row. The graft is trimmed to size. The posterior medial anchor sutures are passed through the posterior hole in the graft. The graft is now introduced into the shoulder. Once laid down, the anterior medial anchor sutures may now be shuttled through the anterior hole that was punched into the graft. Trim the fiber tape loop at the splice to separate the tails. Retrieve one fiber tape from each of the medial anchors out an accessory portal. Preload the fiber tapes into the swivel lock. Prepare a lateral bone socket. Tension the fiber tapes before placing the eyelet in the hole. Do not attempt to apply tension with the eyelet in the bone socket. If it is determined that the tension is not adequate, the driver can be backed out and tension readjusted. Insert the cannulated vented biocomposite swivel lock anchor. The two remaining fiber tape tails are loaded into a second lateral swivel lock anchor. Tension exactly as described for the first lateral anchor and secured by the anchor body. This completes the Tolly Knotless Speed Bridge Repair augmented with Arthroflex Acellular Dermal Extracellular Matrix.